Okay, everyone. Now, today the goal is to set up uh, parent-teacher interviews where they can sign in. Uh, we're going to use a um, program called Doodle. And I already have an account, so what you're going to have to do is um, sign up uh, and create a new account. And I suggest using your uh, .NET account. Now, what we can do in the top right corner is create a Doodle. Or right here, we can just check our account. If we go in our account settings, what you can actually do is I want to um, merge it with my Google Calendar. So if I sign into my .NET account, it will allow me to link all of these things into my Google Calendar. So now my Doodle account is connected. Okay, that sounds great. If you want to do Office 365 or something else, you can do that as well. Um, just make sure that you have the right Pacific time in there as well to make sure that's um, the right spot. And we're going to create a, create a Doodle calendar. I'm going to call it Parent Teacher Interviews. You can call it whatever you want. You can be very specific about your location. I'm going to call it Mr. Page's Classroom. You can add a note if you want to. Now the next step is we are going to, I think you said they're on the 28th. I'm going to pick the 28th. Now here's where I add times. So say if they start at 8.30 in the morning and the next time is at 9 a.m. And then I'm going to start at 9 a.m. and then watch it does it for me for 9.30. Now I'm going to go 9.30 to 10. 10 to 10.30. And you can keep adding these as many times as you want. We'll add one more, 10.30 a.m. to 11. Now I've got my times, I've got the day that I want it on. I'm gonna hit continue. Now this part here is ask for contact information. Yes, I'm gonna want possibly their uh, emails and things like that. Unfortunately, this is with the premium account. So what, what we can do is I wanna make sure it's hidden because the participants names, comments and votes are confidential. I, I only want to see those. You don't want everyone to see that. I'm only going to let the participants, the parents, pick one time and not three or four because it is first come, first serve is the way that I would do it. And um, you, this last one here, participants can indicate if it's an option is not ideal for them. You can just put that in your notes for them to uh, email you if, if the times don't work. I'm going to hit continue. Now here, since we can't get emails to our .NET account, this is where you need to make sure that you change it to your .vc.ca because you won't receive any emails to your .NET account from Doodle. So you can easily change your account from your .NET account. The emails are going to go to your .vc.ca. So I come here, I click Finish. Now this link is important. I would copy this into my part of um, my email when I email parents. Now you can do that from my NBC. You can do that anywhere you want. Um, now I want to make sure that I'm picking the Pacific time zone here. Where is it? Canada Pacific. I can only see who's here. And so I'm going to copy this. Now in my NBC, you can email all the parents that way. So I'm going to go into my NBC, I'm going to log in, now to email parents you first click on student, send email, and I make sure I get rid of students and I put contacts and I also always include the alternate email address. So I can call this parent teacher interviews, you can call it whatever you want here. Um, I always like putting it as a hyperlink so I can go link here and what I do is I highlight that. There it is. I'm going to click on that. I'm going to type that in there. So if they come here and click here, that will go to their link and you can put your name at the bottom and then you scroll down and hit send. I hope this video was useful. I know it was fairly quick but you can watch it a few times if that's what you need to do. Um, thank you very much for your time and let me know if you need anything. Bye.